Many of us woke up Friday morning to news of a mass shooting in Indianapolis. The 19-year-old suspect allegedly killing eight people. It comes at the end of a week that included testimony in the Chauvin trial and new video released in the police killing of a 13-year-old boy, all of it happening in the middle of a pandemic. Drew Pate is chief of psychiatry for LifeBridge Health. We're hearing a lot about people reporting more anxiety and depression, having uh, more uh, emergency room visits uh, across the country for psychiatric related reasons. People are feeling more depressed, thinking about suicide. Dr. Pate says the politics of the year and the insurrection brought a lot of stress to people. The exposure to more and more violence and, you know, the disruption in our social fabric with the police shootings. Uh, you know, the, the, the magnification of the, the racism and the uh, other inequities exist in our society. They're brought forth by COVID. He says the endless loop of images on television and social media have a tendency to desensitize us, and that can be dangerous. The thing you have to do is fight against being desensitized against violence, right? And being aware of your surroundings, aware of your friends, neighbors, when people's attitudes change, if people are posting on social media thoughts about harming others or thoughts about harming themselves, and you know, we can't ignore that sort of stuff. We have to really take a collective responsibility for each other's health and well being. Signs that you need to get help? Your view of the world is changing. You are more irritable. You're sad. Lost your motivation to go to work or to take care of your family. Dr. Pate says if you feel like you need help, start with your primary care physician. If you can't reach them or you don't have one, call 211. Lisa Robinson, WBAL TV 11 News.